What's up guys, Nolan here, and if you ever wondered what was going on with the strange markings around Tarkov or questioning this guy's bathing techniques, it's actually a pretty simple answer. A psychopathic cult that will try to stab you in the night with poison knives. Escape from Tarkov is far from done in terms of development. They'll be adding a lot of new features, gear, and locations before the game is fully released. One of those things is going to be the new scav faction called the Cultists. Today I'm going to break down everything that I know about the Cultists and show off everything that I have for them. Please keep in mind that these things may change by the time that they are live in game, but I do not BS people on my channel. I only talk about what I have reasonable evidence on. The cultists will essentially work just like scavs in terms of spawns, they will have certain locations on certain maps, and apparently also only come out at night. According to Nikita, they will stick to around the marked ritual locations on the maps, such as the marked rooms and dorms of customs, reserve, and the resort, as well as the marked circle on woods. We may also want to expect some new locations or maybe some patrols too, but for now, expect to find them only around the marked locations of maps. Nikita said that they will act differently than normal scavs and actively try to sneak up and ambush you in the night. They will also potentially be armored up or have extra health in some way due to drugs that will make them tougher to kill. The drugs are part of their rituals and may also allow them to do other things like move faster and hit harder. To balance things out a little, at least some of them, if not all of them, will only be armed with a knife, but they will be laced with poison. If you get hit by one, you will be poisoned and you will die within minutes if you do not have the antidote. And yes, there will be an antidote to the poison that you will be able to find and possibly buy, but Nikita seemed iffy about the buying part. He absolutely did say that you can craft it in your hideout, however, and he also said that it may take a long time to craft. BSG will be trying very hard to make these cultists as difficult as possible, but in their own way. Once they are confirmed to be in the game, it will be practically a death sentence to run night raids without sufficient gear and especially night vision so that you can see them. Because remember, they're going to be much quieter than normal. The cultists have been kept as a secret by the BSG team and will actually stay that way up until release. Nikita has said several times that they will not tell anybody when they will be added into the game and the only people that will know are the devs themselves. They may come with 12.6 or they may pop up in a random hotfix. It will be a complete surprise and someday we will be minding our own business trying to rat into the dorms for that golden zibbo and before you know it two dark figures are going to try to sneak up on you and stab you. I honestly can't wait. A little BS here on top since this is my opinion and speculation and I could be completely wrong but I couldn't think of a better time to add them than patch 12.6. It's going to be a wipe, they're going to be making significant changes to the customs map, which is one of the more popular maps that they're going to be found on, and the patch is going to be pretty light on content in general. Maybe think about getting some adult diapers ready for the next patch. If you want to know more about what's coming to Escape from Tarkov during its development, then you can check out my dev news playlist here. If you want to learn anything else in a short no BS fashion, then you can check out my EFT like a pro playlist. If you like this video, then you know the drill. I really appreciate the people who do, otherwise I hope you at least learn something, and I also hope you have a nice day. See you guys!